with a nice bounce pass in the paint. Block shot. Knicks. Skyhawks get it back, though. And nice move there from down. He'll shoot a tough one from the side, off the side of the backboard. Rebound, Knicks. Knicks was impressive on the boards against Middle Tennessee a couple nights ago. And a kick out, Simmons for three. The lefty, no good, strong. Nice rebound, Curry, who hung in the air to pull that one down from beyond the three-point, or the free-throw line. Simon for three. The lefty hits. It's a uh, he uh, really had a heck of a game there. And look, we see Cody Jude coming in the game right now for UNC Asheville. What a luxury it is for them to be able to bring in seven points, 40% three-point shooter. Uh, one of the leaders on this team, a senior for them. The ball movement. Skyhawks perfectly beating. The after, after the way he's looked tonight. It is a one-possession, two-point game now at 31-29 on Kimball's baskets. He's been the difference here. For UNC Asheville, 11 points. The Skyhawks make a change in the lineup. Now in the game, Curry, Jeffrey, Simon, Nixon, Simmons. And these are the five starters who have checked back in. Back door. Oh! Times uh, having to challenge and battle some of these. Nix throws UNC the home Asheville, run pass, and Curry caught it. I don't know how. To Henderson, out to Simon for three. Count it. Yeah, it was a huge play where he looked like a wide receiver just making the play downfield right there. Missed shot, rebound Nick. If he was on a football team, you'd definitely have him in the receiver position. He's got great hands. Simon fakes the shot, drives in with a left hand, scores. Over. Free throw line, but finishing off a lot of plays in deep. Skyhawks will have the ball to begin the second half here as the ball goes in to Simon. Simon at the top of the key. Splits a double team, goes inside with the left hand, and bang down and scores on the other end. So three block shots to go along with his six points. Yeah, Pember making it happen on both ends of the floor. I think Nick's on that offensive rebound would have been a lot better served to just go straight back up with it. The dribble just allowed Pember to get in position. Three-pointer is good. Kimball lets it fly. What a game. Simon foul job of taking most of their looks away. Uh, but what you see there is, you know, you don't talk as much about Kimball as much, but he continues to lead this UNC Asheville team with 14 points on three of a seat right here with those four fouls. Yeah, it's been a physical game. It's gotten testy a couple of times here in this game. Uh, nothing too much, just players talking to each other. No technicals called. Simon with it for the Skyhawks. He goes all the way in and hits. such soft. Hits the free throw now, five points, and the lead is cut to 15. Andre for the Skyhawks, getting it out to Jeffries. UT Martin's lineup, Jeffrey, Simon, Henderson, Nixon, Andre. Stephanie Jones, Kimball, Lawson, Jude in the game for UNC Asheville. UT Martin now down to 50%. They were hovering around the 60% mark shooting for a while. Nick's on the wing outside of his range. Throws it to Simon with the elbow jumper. He banks it in for Quay. Kimball is good. And the 17 lead. The Asheville's just got to get more shots for Kimball. I'm not talking about tonight. I'm talking about during the season. Put him right in there with these other three-point shooters. You, you mentioned it. He shoots 54%. Uh, coming into this game, he'd only attempted 24 threes. But on the night. Four for five. Yeah. He's been red hot. He has 18 points. Skyhawks leading 65-51, up 14. He's really been the lone bright spot offensively. Side. Coach Ritters was talking to be on the radio pregame of, uh, that uh, he would have gone after yeah, Pember. I it, thought that was yeah. funny what he said. Yeah, if he'd have gotten on job, what, about two weeks earlier, yeah. he would have he maybe, maybe he tried to pull it this way too. Here. <laughs> Simon. 